We are at Global for the booth and this year Global for the decided to go into perpetual calendar to explore this complication and they created a special mechanic computer to manage it. So let's have a look. We have a, a very original uh, creation for Global 4C uh, today. It's the uh, Tourbillon 24 second uh, contemporary, but it's a sculpture with uh, the very highest level of diamonds uh, invisibly set. We have sought with the timepiece uh, to uh, set the movement as well, and uh, in this way to uh, keep our architecture very three-dimensional, reinforce it with the diamond set uh, approach, uh, which gives us uh, a totally unique and new piece for our collection today. Can you comment me the difficulty of setting a watch in this way and the quality also of the stones, which are two things that were quite challenging in this model particularly? So the, the difficulty, uh, when we fix the criteria for the uh, diamonds, the quality, we're talking about internally flawless uh, diamonds, individually certificated before and after setting, and invisibly set, but also with a DE color, which is uh, in the best very highest level of uh, color is not really seen in uh, high-end watchmaking uh, to be able to concentrate and focus uh, exclusively on this level of quality of uh, of uh, diamond stone for us it seems natural it was uh, more of a challenge to convince the the diamond setter to be able to uh, uh, pull the whole uh, the whole challenge together and perhaps uh, we might be able to make uh, maybe two pieces a year, but it will be very, very limited and special. We are delighted to be able to share, uh, for the first time, uh, a Global 4C timepiece with uh, calendar indications. So, this is the Global 4C Contiem Perpetuel a Equation, and it's a very, very uh, unique uh, creation for us. We wanted to focus on uh, the accessibility of the indications for the collector, so we have an inline display for the day of the week, the date with large date feature, and the month. This means we are always looking in the same area of the timepiece for the day, uh, date, month indications. And these are our primary elements on the display. Of course, then we have uh, a traditional hour minutes display, uh, the uh, tourbillon system, 24 second tourbillon, to uh, drive and ensure a, a good performance. But what is very uh, unusual is uh, that for Global 4C, this is uh, based upon a mechanical computer. So a coded mechanical computer system enables us to uh, uh, actually bring together the corrections to a very, very low level of complication. So very, very simple to correct the timepiece, just the only correction needing to be done from the winding crown itself. It's um, something, uh, you, you have the GMT watch, it's the second calendar or date watch somehow. Uh, this is really something that is getting stronger and stronger at Global and Forza. Uh, after chronometry, let's say, or at, at the same level as chronometry, there is this indication that must be practical. Is this something really important for Global Forza? I think you, you've put the message there is um, that uh, a Global 4C timepiece, uh, each new creation has to be useful, practical and uh, very, very easily interactive for the collector and the watch enthusiast. So um, we, for the GMT, we were looking at bringing a, a very original but more authentic uh, and easily understandable representation of day and night thanks to the rotating three-dimensional globe. With the QP Equation, uh, we have uh, sought there to again bring a simplicity in terms of the, the use of the timepiece to render it practical. Um, and so this is, this is a, really a key element of the focus. Um, we, uh, we love complications, of course, but uh, we do not want to make a complication just for the sake of the complication. We have to be able to uh, uh, satisfy our creative uh, passion to be able to add something to the story and to be able to uh, bring a completely new representation in our own uh, original and specific way. Thank you very much. Thank you very much.